Bimanual laryngoscopy involves reaching around the patient's neck with your right hand and applying pressure on the thyroid cartilage. This simple and fast maneuver does two important things. First, the opposing forces of the blade tip and external manipulation drive the tip of the curved blade fully into the vollecula, causing effective epiglottis elevation. Second, it pushes the larynx backward into better alignment with the laryngoscopist's line of sight. Bimanual laryngoscopy, or ELM, is not cricoid pressure. Cricoid pressure is done by an assistant to prevent passive regurgitation of stomach contents in high-risk aspiration situations. Bimanual laryngoscopy is deliberately done to improve laryngeal view. The goal is first-pass success and avoiding episodes of bag mask ventilation. Fine movements of the blade tip at the vollecula and subtle changes in pressure and direction of force can cause dramatic differences in laryngeal exposure. Bimanual laryngoscopy is about connecting these fine movements at the anterior neck with direct observation of laryngeal view. After the view has been optimized by the laryngoscopist, an assistant can transiently maintain external manipulation at this location, freeing the laryngoscopist's right hand to place the tracheal tube.